Well, it's another beautiful spring day out here uh, on the lower part of the property. And I've been digging out of this bank, which is just a massive deposit of river material, uh, all on the inside bend and a little mix of kind of erosion and river deposits. But a lot of fine gold. The last pan I got, there were probably 10 pieces of fine gold in it. Not really getting a lot of nuggets out of here at all. Uh, when the nuggets are just right in the river course. So I wonder if this may actually be an old glacial river channel that's melting into the river uh, from into the hill. Uh, perpendicular to the river. Um, so what I've got here are some roots and um, moss is a great gold catch. Okay, so you can read about these in books like uh, Dave McCracken's book um, that he wrote in the 80s and I'm sure he's written newer versions of it. But uh, he's written a lot of good stuff uh, published by Keen Engineering in the 80s probably and on um, but what I'm gonna do is I hope this I'm gonna try to kind of rush through this pan um, because I'm just I don't have much memory on this phone what can I say I really should probably get a better phone if I plan on doing YouTube videos but this is what I'm working with so I wish I had somewhere to put this down because it's a heavy 15 inch pan there's still mud and this isn't going very well, but I'm making the best of it. Pan's doing donuts and let's just get this done, shall we? A lot of heavy black sand on the edges. Okay, and that you don't see that too much in the river. That's why I think there's actually an old channel melting right into the river here. So let's see what we got here. And with the fine gold, you really got to pan it down very well to see it. When I say fine, this is fine for me. Look at all that black sand. There's already a piece of gold on top. See that thing moving? And so the roots had some gold in it. There's a piece of gold right there. Another piece of gold there. And it's some more on the side here, another piece over there. Like you can see, some more over there. As you can see, there's a lot of fine gold in there. The question is, is it going to turn into nuggets or is it going to just stay like that? Like, even if it just stayed like that, that's actually what you're kind of looking for. See that? That's what you're looking for when you're setting up a mining operation. Not the nuggets. See all that fine gold in there? Look at all that gold coming out now. Whoa, look at that. Okay. You want stuff like this. You don't want the nuggets, because usually where you find the big nuggets, it's not commercially viable, there's a lot of water, it's not in the water. This is a great deposit that I could go right into a wash plant and take a lot of gold out of here, but unfortunately due to California laws, that's not possible. What 